Good morning. It's a great day out there today and I'm about to make a delicious breakfast so I can get a good start to the day. So as you can see I have some green pepper, some mushrooms, some onion, a couple of eggs and uh, let's get started. Okay, first thing we have to do is uh, get our eggs out of our eggshell. So I'm using a pen and a hammer. And I have to decide. One side I will have to make a little bit bigger hole. Oh, but this breakfast is going to be so good. And just to let you know, I do clean my eggs. I wash my eggs off first. I also wash my pen with soap and water. Cannot wait for this delicious breakfast. Now, sometimes when you're uh, preparing the egg to get the egg out, little bits of the shell kind of break, so you have to have to be ready. Get a napkin or something just to get that egg shell away from the hole that you're about to get your egg out of. Okay, I don't know if you can see that, but I made a hole. This side only may have one pinhole. Now I'm going to get the egg out. We're done. One more egg and I can start my breakfast. Mmm. I don't know why they make it so hard to get the egg out of the shell, but it's worth it. Eggs are delicious. I hate when I have several people over for breakfast, though.
All right, now we're going to add a little bit of <clears throat> milk to the eggs. And let me get a sharp knife and cut up. Better turn that heat off. Don't know if you can see, but I'm cutting up some onion. Let's cut up a little more of this pepper. Oh, love the smell. Okay, we're going to let that warm up a little bit. Use a little bit of Pam in my pan. Just a tad of salt and pepper in my eggs. Simple breakfast, but so delicious. And I'm telling you, those peppers, oh, the aroma makes your whole kitchen smell wonderful. Can't believe it's not butter? Oh, yes, you can. But it's healthier. Okay. This is wheat toast. Well, actually, it's not really wheat toast because my husband picked up the wrong bread at the market. It's oatmeal toast. I don't know a whole lot about oatmeal toast, so I don't or oatmeal bread, so I don't know if it's good for you like wheat bread. And there we go. 
Hope your day is starting off as delicious as mine. I'll bet you're wondering what we're going to do with all of these empty eggshells. Well, it's almost Easter, so I thought maybe I would show you how to color Easter eggs. Hang on, the next video will be uh, creating Easter eggs. Colorful Easter eggs. See you then.